You know, we touched on it on the headlines, the success this season of the Madison Radicals, and they are getting ready for the playoffs here in 2018. Let's bring in the head coach, Tim DeBile, right now. He's going to fill us all in on it. Tim, you guys finished up the regular season against Chicago. How did it end up going? Great. Uh, they, Chicago actually jumped on us early and I think it was up 6-2 and uh, then we went on a big run and uh, we won 27-24 and it was a good way to end the season. We rested a few guys but we really wanted to get the win uh, just to, to kind of you know, roll into the playoffs uh, with some momentum. Absolutely. Well, you guys knocked it out of the park in the regular season. You go 12-2. and two. You're beating teams by an average of seven goals per game. Were you happy with the 2018 regular season? Yeah, we really were. Uh, we had that one game against Raleigh at home that uh, we kind of regret uh, how we came out. We we had one bad quarter where they you know they scored I think seven in a row on us. Uh, it's the worst quarter we've ever played. And other than that, the season was was great. And you know we're happy to to win another Midwest title this year. You know we've talked about yeah you talk about winning another title. And we've talked about it on the show how consistent you guys are year in year out. Five straight Midwest Division championships. How do you guys keep that level of excellence up year in and year out? Uh, it's just the dedication to the players. Um, they, you know, they basically take maybe two months off. Uh, they start training again in uh, December. Um, we we start practice in January. We, we practice January to April before the season even starts. And you know, I think that shows on the field. Uh, every year, the team just gets better and better. And these players are, are just so dedicated to to becoming better players and a better team. You guys get a bye week heading into the playoffs, July 28th, the Saturday night at Bree Stevens going to be the next game, and it is going to be against whom? Uh, well, I think it's going to be against Minneapolis, but they have to travel down and, uh, and play Indianapolis beforehand. So uh, it's hard to say. Uh, you know, Indianapolis has a better record right now. Uh, I think Minnesota is the tougher team. Uh, so I'm, but I'm kind of hoping it's Indianapolis. All right, that would be nice. And what would also be nice is if you guys can make it to that championship weekend again. And this year again, it is going to be in Madison at Bree Stevens Field. Championship game number seven. Are you guys going to be there for that? Yeah, I mean, we, we're planning on it. That's, that's the goal. That's been the goal since uh, January when we had our first practice. And, you know, I think we're peaking right now. We've kind of ramped up in the last three games. Three games have been great. And, uh, you know, we're ready for the playoffs. What kind of an advantage is it for you guys to be playing at home for that? I mean, you need to win three in a row to win the championship. All three of those are going to be at Bree Stevens. Yeah, I mean, I, don't, I can't think what our record is off the top of our head, but I mean, we've lost maybe six games there in the last uh, six years, so hmm. we feel pretty good in, in the in, at Breeze. Uh, it's quite an advantage to us. The, the home field uh, fans are so great. Um, you know, we know the ins and outs of that stadium and just not having to travel. So, I mean, this is definitely a, a rare opportunity to win a championship for us, and we, we definitely want to uh, take care of business. Absolutely. And the cool thing is all those games will be right here on Channel 57, so we are excited about that. Hey, Tim, thank you so much. Great regular season. Good luck going forward. Thanks a lot. A special thank you to Conan Automotive in Stoughton for supporting local athletics.